Estimation of length. Friends, in the previous video, we learned about using your hand span, cubit, and small things as the unit of length measurement for measuring the length of an item. Today, along with Chintu and Mintu, we will use other parts of our body to estimate the length of objects. Brother, we have already eaten. Hmm, you were going to teach me to determine length of objects by using our feet as unit of measurement, weren't you? Yes, come, I will teach you. Mindu, you know we can measure the length of anything with our foot span. How long is a foot span, brother? Please tell me. The length of the big toe of the foot to the heel of the foot is a measure of foot span. Okay, I got it. Brother, can I measure the length of our carpet by using my feet? Yes, you surely can. Please tell me, how do I have to measure this carpet? Look, the length of this carpet is from here to here. Okay, so first of all, I will put my right foot on the carpet like this. So, this is the length of one foot span, right? Now, I will place the left foot in front of the right foot, slightly touching the right foot in front, like this. Then this would be the length of two foot span. Now I will raise my right leg and place it in front of my left leg. There is a length of three foot span. Right, brother? Now I walk through the length of the carpet. So, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, and this is ten. The length of this carpet is as long as my ten feet. Okay, Mintu, now tell me what will be the length of the doormat that is placed there? If the length of the doormat placed near the door is half that of this carpet, then the approximate length of the mat should be equal to 5 foot span. Rightly said, Mintu. Now, let me show you a magic. Magic? Yes. Now I will measure this carpet with my feet. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, and eight. Hey, the length of this carpet is only eight feet. Brother, length of this carpet has been reduced by your magic. <laughs> Mintu. The carpet did not shrink. Look carefully. My feet are longer than yours. And your feet are shorter than mine. Oh, that's how measurement of the same carpet came out differently. Yes, Mintu, because everyone's body parts vary in size. So everybody gets Different measurements. Yes, now I understand that hand span, cubit, and foot span, these units are not always the same. Yes, and always keep in mind that these units are not correct because everyone's measurements are different. Brother, Today I had so much fun. I will teach this to my friends too. 
<laughs> Friends, in this video, we learn to measure the length of things using some other parts of our body and learned that the length of every human body is not equal. In the next video, we will learn interesting things related to the correct measurement of length.